Oh boy, we breaking out of this joint. How? <laughs> hmm. What are our options, Shiny okay. Boy? Time to clear off now. This whole hospital is so quiet. That's so good. don't make any noise. And find a way to get the hell out of here. Fine, don't. Okay, so we got our stuff. Joey could probably distract the guard dog. Hmm. I don't know about that. I don't know if I want to involve Joey. I mean, Joey is so nice, but I mean, he's got a regular job. We don't want to involve him in crimes unnecessarily, <laughs> like breaking out a wanted fugitive. No, and a curiosity. Okay, so I have all my letters. Cassidy's letter, Chris's letter, and grandparents' letter. And we got our book back. Did we write anything about our plans for tonight? Um, I don't think so. Oh, that's 79. Not... Oh, hey, he put all of, all of his stuff from the, uh, the hospital in here. Nice. Uh, Flores tried to frame me <laughs> again. Can't blame her for trying. Nice. Hey, we even put our drawing in here. Okay, awesome. All right. Well, I'm assuming we have to steal a car. We're not taking the card with us? Weird. Maybe I could, uh, rig it. Decoy Sean in the bed. Huh. Sure. I guess we can't tie it like a rope to climb out the window, eh? I'll keep that for now. Press I to toggle on off your inventory. Have I been able to do that the whole... I didn't know I could do that the entire there time. There must be a way to leave this room without alerting anyone. Um. I should close these. So nobody sees me sleepwalking away. Fair Can enough. I have some privacy, please. <laughs> Can I have some privacy, please. Gosh darn. Okay, so I'm like, where's my inspect? <sighs> Wish I could just walk out. <laughs> well, yeah. Construction room. <sighs> They've been working on these rooms forever. Okay. <sighs> so fucking loud. <laughs> My backpack has got to be somewhere around here. Really? Why would they keep it so close at hand? Shouldn't that be at the police station? Sweet dreams, my friend. Maybe I can trick him. Ha! <laughs> yeah, right. Say I need an aspirin or something. Mm, let's hold off on that for now. I don't want to wake him... Oh! I don't want to wake him unnecessarily. Could you? Could you? Thank you. Let's see. I just gotta get past that locked door. And an angry guard. Piece of cake. Hello? Loading the bathroom. Bar. Check. <sighs> yeah. That metal bar isn't going anywhere. Check. This one isn't screwed in. Hmm. I could pull it off, but it's gonna be loud. Okay, let's hold off on that. What are our options? So we can call Joey. We can try and check the police. Well, the security guard. We can tear off that thing. Okay, the guard is sleeping. Can make a fake this body with This is a big chance, stuff. dude. Can I use? Is the sheets long enough for me to shimmy? Oh, it's <sighs> stuck. Need a superhero to open that shit. Danielle, where are you? I can inspect. Hope my last view of this world isn't this window. <laughs> Cars. One stupid car. Then I'm out of here. Okay. It's dead tonight. Works for me. Man, I really gotta turn my head a lot to be able to see. Um. Boop-a-doop-a-doop. Ah. Ah. 
I could slip into one of those rooms under construction. Oh, like you mean step out? Okay. So not using the sheets. What happens if he tries to open it again? <sighs> Can't open that window with my bare hands. Okay. Can't do anything about that, eh? Um, how about... We'll make a fake body since we're not gonna need the sheets. <sighs> that looks so fake. <laughs> but it might work for a second. Yeah, with this kind of guard that we have, it might, uh, he might just glance in. Oh, there's something up there. Boss is dos. Checking the seat. Please don't fall. Eh, well, that's not going to be strong enough to hold your weight. Too bad this isn't a movie. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Can't even fit. All right. Well, I think we're going to need this to open the window. I don't want to alert the guard, and I don't want to involve Joey, so... <sighs> Let's do it. Yeah. <clears throat> hey! What the hell are you doing in there? He's in the bathroom! Doesn't say a thing. Nice job, Sean. Now the guard is awake and pissed off. Daijaba. Don't worry about it. I can ambush him. Is he asleep again? I could trick him into coming in here and then. Nah, 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 nah. Get him out? Nope. Nope, nope. Okay. Let's. What? Oh, we could hide behind here to ambush. Maybe. Sheesh. I could get Joey to help me. Yeah. Would he get busted? Yeah. I don't want to get Joey busted. If we're going to be a criminal, it's on our own terms, except for when we're stealing yo yo's because we're out of money. <laughs> Not my fault. Oh. Yes! Quieter than before. Yee. Hey, that worked. All right, nice and slidey. Can you at least take off your socks when you're doing this? Where is my take off socks option? This is gonna be so slidey. Now or never. This is crazy, dude. Yeah. Don't freak out. Just hum the Mission Impossible Just theme in your head. Get out. It'll make you braver. We can do this. We only got one eye. This is terrible. We wouldn't die, right? I wish we could take off our socks. You'd have more grip, man. You can just carry them. Oh, I'm glad you're walking. Oh. You're not. You're just allowing me the option. Don't think. Do do just do 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 keep going. No, 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 no. Take a breath, dude. Don't you do that. We were doodling. All right. Nice and easy. Just, just breathe. Nice and easy. Don't fall. Escape. Whew. Huh, that affects both of us, huh? Damn. That's interesting. Way too close. So even though Daniel's not with me, my choices are still affecting him somehow. <laughs> I guess when we explain to him how we got out of here one day, he'll be like, wow, my brother was so cool. He was like a spy and stuff. I bet, you, I bet the Mission stuff. Impossible music was playing when he was doing all of this. It's really lucky there was work going on next door. 
Okay, so he fell asleep again. Man, he is the sleepiest security guard okay. ever. The guard is sleeping. This is your big chance, dude. Good thing David's not uh, keeping tabs on us because he would be awake. Could you close it a little quieter, Sean? We're trying to be sneaky. They even left your hoodie and everything here? Pardon? I mean, I'll take it. Why didn't you close that door again? You gotta make leave it clean, man. We should have actually closed the um, hospital window behind us as well, because that was like a dead giveaway that we escaped out the window. Oh, uh, well. Whatever. That's... That's Finn. Finn? No way. What, huh. what is he doing here? Um... He wouldn't narc on me, right? <laughs> I kind of want to talk to him. I mean... I'm still pissed at him from last episode, but I feel like we're never going to see him again if we don't talk to him now. Let's let's see. I feel like he would be okay. He he has had our back. He is a cool guy. He just is selfish and made some bad choices. Finn. Finn. Hey, over here. Holy fucking shit. <laughs> no way. Hey, uh Sean. What the hell are you doing here? I'm trying to bail. Son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I knew you were here. Could have hooked up. Thanks, Shit. man. So, where's Daniel? <sighs> um. Shoot. How much do I tell him? Ah. <sighs> Do I say he's in Nevada? Finn... Yeah. I'd like to believe he wouldn't narc on us, but I don't know. I just... I can't tell. I can't tell you, Finn, but I'm going to get him back. Good. Don't blame you for not trusting me anymore. My fault you're in here. Uh... How are you? So... Stupid question, but how are you doing? <laughs> well, <laughs> you know, <laughs> kind of sucks. No coconut drinks here. So, how bad is it? The eye? Your mm. eye. Let's say I still got one left. John, I know this doesn't mean shit to you now. But I am sorry. <sighs> About everything. <laughs> you are selfish. I don't know what too easy means. Like, you're selfish is obviously like, yeah, you're a selfish prick who got us all in trouble. Still, he recognized that he needed to apologize. So, there's that. I would like to take his apology, but it's also I not I don't blame you. I'm going to do this just to see what cuz I don't know what that is. I know what the other two are. Then it's way too late for that. Hmm. Too easy. Oh. Sorry friend, you lost your eye and your little brother. Whatever. It's over. I don't need any sorry. Ow. That hurts. I, I didn't really want to do that. After everything, I do care about you, Sean. And I'm still sorry. Yeah. It's a sorry fucking world. Hold on. Sorry, I don't... I don't want that choice. I didn't know what it meant. Sometimes I wish these dialogue choices had a little bit more to them. Okay, so now i got to climb through all of this again, unfortunately. Damn. 
Oh, thank you for not making me shimmy Wait across. Okay. So now I just need to get back to Finn. Yeah, sorry for reloading, guys. Normally I would just t stick with my decisions, but I didn't want Sean to be like, well, I'm so glad you're sorry. Oh, Whoopity doo. I mean, Catherine. yeah, but I don't want my, my Sean, I don't want my Sean to be so embittered against everybody and everything. <sighs> I wish there was a better third option there. Okay, the guard is sleeping. That, that was, like, the me. harshest, I think, of the three, which was not... I was, like... I was hoping too easy he was going to say... You know, it's all well and good to say sorry after the fact, but... It was really fucked up what you did kind of thing. More of a discussion than, like, well, bully for you, my friend. Uh, it's too bad I can't actually skip through all of this. But... That is one choice I want to redo. I don't like that one at all that I picked. Oh, if only we had the power of time travel. Max, oh, Max, oh, Max, where are you when I need you? To reload my dialogue choices. <laughs> That's... That's Finn. Yeah, say no hello. Way. What is he doing here? Wake up. Finn. Finn. Hey, Finn. over here. Holy fucking shit. No way. Sean, what the hell are you doing here? I'm trying to bail. Son of a bitch. <laughs> I wish I knew you were here. Could have hooked up. Shit. So, where's Daniel? Okay, gonna stick with I can't the can't tell. tell. You, Finn, but I'm going to get him back. Good. Don't blame you for not trusting me anymore. My fault you're in here. How are you? So, stupid question, but how are you doing? Well, <laughs> you know, <laughs> kind of sucks. No coconut drinks here. So, how bad is it? Your eye. Let's say. I was thinking about doing the. One left. Your selfish Sean. option, but at the risk of him being like super angry about it again, <laughs> I think I'll yeah, just do sorry. the more apologetic of. I mean, more accepting of the apology <sighs> of the about three. Everything. <sighs> just because. We're bigger. Besides, we've kind of sold him out to the FBI. <laughs> I don't blame you, Finn. You tried something. Even if it ended up being a mistake. I'll just... have to make things right for good now. You're the man, Sean. We are the man. We're too good I'm to you. I'm really gonna miss you. Much love and respect. Always. Thank I you, gotta bro. go now. Take care, Finn. You're gonna find him, Sean. I trust you. So you should trust yourself, too. Yeah, that's a better goodbye for us to Finn. I'd rather leave like that than with bad blood between us still. Because, I mean, Finn is really immature. He didn't think that through at all and got a lot of people hurt and hopefully it got him to think a little more seriously going forward because it was done with good intentions. The intentions weren't bad. He wasn't deliberately trying to get me and Daniel into trouble, but he just didn't think, he just didn't think, period. <laughs> and I'd rather leave on good terms with him. He was a cool guy. I really, really liked him. Aside from the whole stealing plan, that was just dumb, man. <laughs> Sheesh. Alright, so a car was unlocked. Man, you can still jack a car with one eye. Good on you, Sean. Wouldn't it be really hard to start driving with one eye? 
tear out of there. Not a problem. Like, he's had to relearn, like, how to look at things with just one eye now. But he's just driving. Whew, I hope we don't get pulled over. <laughs> That's gonna be a lot of problems. But we got out of there fairly pain painlessly. We didn't involve Joey, which I was glad about. We didn't hurt the security guard, which I'm glad about. And I am glad I reloaded that option with Finn, because that was like, woohoo, ouch. <laughs> that, was, that was pretty brutal. Because he didn't have to apologize. So I wanted to acknowledge that. Don't you fall asleep! Oh my goodness, dude. Don't do that to me. I'll die, man. <laughs> Good God. Get yourself some coffee somewhere. Gas station coffee, I don't know. There must be some change. I guess all of our money is gone from our backpack. <laughs> oh, that sucks. Oh, we cut our hands so badly and all that stuff. Oh, okay. Yeah, I gotta check our backpack situation when I get a chance. So you drove through the night. And you have a map, so you know where you're going to Nevada. That's pretty impressive. I wouldn't be able to read a map and get my way to, to, to Nevada, I don't think. I'd be pretty lost. I don't think that would end well for me. Aw, see looking over there like, I wish Daniel was here. Hmm. Imagine if we had had a car this whole time. <laughs> How much faster the journey would have been. I guess he has to get like a fair ways away before he can take some time to sleep. But I hope he pulls over soon. Oh my god. I made it to the title screen! Yay! <laughs> I forgot about the title screen again. That was only the second episode into episode four though, right? So that wasn't too bad. I think it took me three last time? All right. Well, I'm glad we don't have to walk through the desert, at least. Welcome to Nevada. Sweet. Making some good time. Now we just gotta find Haven Point. Have you gotten any sleep yet, sir? I was surprised, actually, that he fell- he was falling asleep as fast as he was when he left the hospital, because I would think the adrenaline of, like, oh my god, did I escape? Are they gonna get me any minute? Would have, like, kept me awake for a while. I guess once that wore off, though, you'd get really tired really fast. Okay. Well, it's night time. I wonder if we're gonna get our collectible here, because now we have the car. Gotta keep my eye out. <sighs> all my efforts to keep you from smoking, Sean, and it was all for naught. <laughs> Every time you get the option to do a stuff, you just do it anyway. How will you run, sir? Trying to take care of your body while it's trying to heal its eyeballs and the wounds and everything. <sighs> Get back out of the car. I'm looking for a collectible, man. Guess this is my room for the night. Get out of the car. Fuck. My eyes itchy. Oh. I should probably clean it before I doze off. Okay. Just a moment. We have s whoa. Hello. We have s what do we have to say about this? 
I'm so glad I didn't lose it. It's the only thing I got left from Dad. Stop going down, please. We lost our condoms! Hey. Figured as much. The cops took all my cash. Where'd you get the 1719? Oh my god, please stop. Lost my dad's picture, but somehow this thing is still here. Wouldn't they have confiscated the USB key first thing? So they took... Oh, they took our dad's picture? Sheesh. Why do I even keep these? Nothing's waiting for us back home. At least having only one eye amps up my disturbed artist cred. That's something. At least I'm still official. Sean Eduardo. I never noticed that before. Five foot seven. Brody's letter. I bet you would help me right now, bro. Brody. Yep, brother of the year. That's me. Can't believe this lasted this long. <laughs> right? Gonna need all this medical shit now. And this. Seems pretty useless in this heat. But I hear nights are rough out here. Okay, where did you get that jacket? Clean up your eye. Okay, so we took some time to write. Snuck out of the hospital through the window. Wasn't easy with only one eye. Didn't realize how fucking high up I was. Maybe it helped? Aw, shit. <laughs> Bumped into Finn on my way down the scaffolding. It messed me up. Brought back too many memories. But, gotta focus on what's most important. Reach Nevada, find Daniel. He actually did like a fairly good Finn drawing. Is that like a blind wolf walking across a tight rope? <laughs> oh no! So, so hard to drive. Fucking miracle I haven't been in a wreck yet. Gonna pull over soon so I can rest. Driving in the dark with one eye is the absolute worst. Would feel a lot safer walking on the edge of the cliff on a moonless night. Sheesh. Yeah, this looks like it might be here. Shit. I will never hold until Haven Point. Dang. Could you, um, use some of your money for gas to get there? <sighs> what a mess. <sighs> Pelotis can now add Grand Theft Auto to my file. That's true. She can legitimately uh, charge us with that. Oh, come on. Did you interview everyone in that hospital? <laughs> or what? Probably. Desperate to get some info. Because there's nothing. She seems nice. Sorry I stole your car, guys. Aww. Shit. Guess I fucked up her day pretty bad. What did she have to do? Drop off kids. Hospital checkup. Lunch with hubby. Miss Scott's x-ray blood test. Pick up kids. Night shift. Oof. Must do. Um... Guess I'm kind of lucky I stole a smoker's car. Okay. Haven Point is straight ahead. Just a few more hours drive. Okay. But like you said, this thing is not going to last till then. Oh. That's the collectible? Really? Lone Wolf. Well, that's definitely not going on our backpack, I'll tell you that much. Um, I guess I need the medical stuff for my eyeball. I've already forgotten how I'm supposed to do this. <laughs> Saline solution, and then cream, and then new... I don't thing? even know how long I should keep on using this for. Uh, guess still it's not itchy anymore. <laughs> Maybe. Alright. Careful. Uh, 
Okay, are you just doing it automatically? Because that's much appreciated, John. Ah, man. Ugh. I should have listened to Joey. Yeah, have you this not been doing it four times a day? Dude. Do I just... What do I do now? Get some sleep! Okay. Do I have to turn off? Yeah, there we go. Night night, everyone. Shouldn't you? You should put your chair back, man. You'd be way more comfy. Your arm's gonna be dead. Alright, don't listen to me.